Today, I'm doing a lip blush procedure, but first, I'm gonna allow my client to try it using our brand new lip blush things. This step helps to reduce client anxiety as she can preview her chosen shade from our range of 12 colors. So have a look at the color chart. Tell me some of the colors you like to wear. Mm. The nude is really nice. Oh, dusty pink, I really like dusty pink. Okay, so we'll try both of those. This is nude. I'm gonna apply a small amount so you can see what the heel tattoo would look like. All right, have a look. Oh, I really like it. Can we try dusty pink too? Yeah, of course. Have a look. I love it. This is the one. Let's do it. Okay, I'll remove it before we get started. Okay. Use a makeup remover to clean off the lip blush stain before tattooing. I always use a pencil to pre-draw my shape. Now I'm going to create the shape by using the matching lip pencil to draw it. Sharpen your pencil and draw your outline on clean lips. This pencil matches the lip blush stain you tried on earlier. And I'm gonna use it to pre-draw your shape so I know where to tattoo. Okay. Do you want me to follow your natural lip line? Yeah, I like a more natural lip. Okay. When you're drawing your client's shape, use her natural lip as a guide. Once you guys are happy with the shape, you're ready to go. Now I'm going to ink it. Prepare the matching pigment to your client's chosen color. My method is to create the outline first by tattooing in the borders, then building up the color, filling in the inside, and adding more and more layers until I get the color that I want. <laughs> 